Hey everybody, thank you so much for joining me today. Today I wanted to share with you my recent REI purchase. I am hoping to do some half marathons coming up soon. So I wanted to get a hydration vest. I have been looking at these hydration vests for a while now and REI finally had the sale 20% off one item and then I had some dividends to use. So I went ahead and bought one. So let's check it out and see what's inside. So here is the hydration vest. Of course, I bought Osprey. I love this brand so much. I even have an Osprey luggage. My carry-on is Osprey. I have so many of their backpacks. I just love all of the details they have. So I went with Osprey for the hydration pack, although I did look at the Nathan one as well. So if you have that one, let me know how that one is working out. But here it is. This is called the Dyna 6. It is made for women. Here is the other side with the vest. And I've never worn anything like this. I normally just wear a belt and squeeze some water bottles in there. So this is new for me to have a vest instead of a belt, but I can't wait to try it. I am a little nervous that it's gonna rub, but stay tuned. I'm gonna go ahead and test it out and show you guys at the end of the video how this actually really worked for me. But let's go through it real quick while it is brand new, fresh out of the package. One thing that I really loved about it were these big pockets and I tested it out in the store and my phone does fit in these pockets. So I can just slide my phone in there so you guys will not miss a Vacation Races documentary because I love to make videos on these half marathons. I'm not doing it for time. I'm doing it just to be out there and experience the beauty. So during my run, I can just zip my phone out of the pocket and start videoing when I need to. Also, I use energy chews. So I'm thinking I can put those in another one of the pockets. These pockets are super stretchy. So you have this top pocket and then a smaller pocket right here, and that's on both sides of the vest. On the other side as well, you've got the top pocket and a smaller pocket. So the inside is mesh, so I'm hoping that this will help keep me cool. And it's also really soft and comfortable, and it does have the snaps that I'm used to on my other Osprey bags. Here it is snapped, and then you just pull it to make it as tight or loose as you would like. And then it has a magnet right here for your hydration system. So that just snaps there. And in the back, we have this stretchy pocket. Again, this can adjust um, to how loose or tight you'd like it. And in my other Osprey bags, I'm always able to fit my Patagonia because those pack down pretty tight. So that can usually fit right there. So if I'm in a race that starts out cold, I can just throw hopefully a thin jacket in this area right here. Then I'm gonna unclip that. There's three more pockets. So here's the first pocket. And again, one thing I love about Osprey is they just have such great details. Just the tab pulls are so convenient, easy to open. Here is the middle compartment. Again, typical Osprey, I love it. A place to keep my keys. I'm always scared I forgot them or Put them somewhere weird so this is a great way to just have them attached know they're not going to fall out and it does have some organizational pockets in here as well so this is just a, i love these little pockets at the top just a small for your necessities that you need to get to quickly and then the last one is for your hydration pouch and this does come with the hydration system so here is the hydration bladder and I'm gonna try this out. I've never used one of these. Before I take it out on its first run, here's another look at the beautiful Dyna 6 by Osprey hydration vest. So let's take it out. Let's see how it works. All right, to open it, you just slide off the gray part of the top. You unfold it, and then you just un pull that apart right there, and I just, squeeze on the edges to keep it open and then you just pour in your water. I did not fill mine all the way today because I do not need that much water but once it is filled to the amount you need just fold over the top and slide the gray piece back so it is sealed. Then I'm going to place it back into the bag slides right in there 
And then I'm gonna use this clip right here and thread this through. and secure it to the bag. I'm about to go on my first run. I did adjust this strap to the third level down. It was too close to my neck. So we'll see how that goes. I may end up moving it back up, but we have this. And then once again, this pocket right here for my phone is super roomy. So I love that. And then we have these twist these ties here on the edge for a super snug fit. All right, so far so good. It feels tight and secure and I'm loving it. I'm a few miles into my inaugural hydro vest run and so far I am super impressed. It fits great. It's a little hot out here, but the mesh is really making it comfortable and it's nice just to have my water on standby when I need it. All right, you guys, I'll see you at the end. I am finished with my first run in my Osprey Hydro Vest, and I loved it. The one negative is the water did taste like plastic because it's brand new, but hopefully after a few uses, I'll power through that and the water will start tasting just like water again. But that's normal, I read about that. But other than that, everything was great. The fit was great. There was not the bounce that I was anticipating. So I look forward to using it in my half marathon in a few weeks. And as always, thank you so much for watching and please subscribe.